Well, it might not feel like spring, but it is definitely the time of year for spring cleaning. Street sweeping kicks off tomorrow in Minneapolis. So how do street sweepers work and where does all that debris end up? Good question. WCCO's Jeff Wagner got the dirt on this dirty job. Bristles bustling down the block. A sight and sound that shows spring is in the air. Why is street sweeping necessary? We keep all the debris out of the drains and that's why we pick it up every year. Ted Davison is a supervisor with Minneapolis sure. Public Works. What's happening behind you right now? So that's our water truck just trickling down. A sprinkle of water is the first step for street sweeping. It's good to have it wet, uh, it picks up better, dust control. It's then followed by two sweepers with the second scooping up with the first left behind both buzzing along around five to seven miles per hour. You can't go too fast, you're gonna leave it all behind. In the days ahead, crews will clean 1,100 miles of road. That's on top of the 400 miles of alleys already completed. Does it spin a certain way to ensure it goes underneath? It pushes everything underneath. The outer brooms send the debris to a center brush and from there to a back broom. In the back broom twirls to make it go up into the conveyor. Those are some pretty heavy duty bristles, you would say? Yes, yes. They're made of steel, but still wear down. And then, you know, when they get short, we change them out. You know, we won't make it all season with that. Davison says one crew will cover dozens of miles in a day, but they stop frequently to unload into a truck that follows along. What happens to all the stuff it collects? So we collect it all and we bring it to a, a dump site and then it, it sits for a, long, for a while to it uh, composts and then we, use, then we uh, get it trucked out to a landfill and they use it on top coat. It's a slow but sure process to polish the pavement and the crews just have a few requests. Don't put your leaves in the street, don't put your brush in the street and move your car. But I can't say, hey, I think I dropped my keys in the street the day before. Can I uh, check to see if you guys have it? Jeff Wagner. I'm not going to be able to find it's it. It's gone. It's gone. <laughs> WCCO. It's happened. Yeah, I, I have no doubt. Four news. Well, there is another full city sweeping effort in the fall, but the trucks are out cleaning all summer. I appreciate those guys. Yeah, they, do really. a, they do a nice job. Uh, the city asks the drivers be patient and only pass a truck if there is a safe area and you're able to do so. If you have a good question for Jeff, just email him through WCCO.com slash links.